What's up guys? This is Derek House from DHFTNS.com and today I'm going to show you guys how to make my hot chocolate protein oatmeal. So let's get to it. The first thing you're going to do is take out a microwave bowl safe bowl and then put half a cup or 40 grams of rolled oats into it half a cup or four ounces of sugar-free vanilla coconut milk. If you don't like or can't find coconut milk, you could use regular milk or any other milk substitute. And a fourth a cup or two ounces of water. Microwave your oatmeal for around two minutes. Next, we're gonna add in the rest of our ingredients and you're gonna wanna do so while your oatmeal is still hot, starting with one tablespoon or 17 grams of chocolate peanut butter, one pack, which is eight grams of a diet hot cocoa mix. You can find these at pretty much any grocery store and they only cost around a dollar a box. One scoop or 30 grams of chocolate protein powder, one tablespoon or five grams of cocoa powder. If you didn't know already, cocoa powder has no sugar in it and two grams of fiber for every 10 calories, so it's a great source of fiber. And last, two tablespoons or 12 grams of marshmallow fluff. Mix everything together. And there is your hot chocolate protein oatmeal. As you guys saw, the oatmeal is done, so now I'm just gonna try a bite. All I really have to say about this is that it tastes like a really good hot chocolate with marshmallows in it. It's absolutely delicious and probably one of my favorite protein oatmeal recipes that I've made on this channel so far. As far as the calories go in the whole recipe, there's 477, 13 grams of fat, 53 grams of carbs, 8 grams of fiber, and 37 grams of protein. Every now and then, I do like to suggest buying a kitchen scale if you don't already have one. It's probably one of the best investments for your kitchen. The one I'm using only costs around $25 shipped, does grams and ounces, will last you forever, and comes in a ton of different colors. I will post a link in the description below to where you can buy it. Alright guys, I just want to thank you for watching. If you like this recipe, please go ahead and give me a thumbs up. It motivates me to keep making these. If you haven't already subscribed and you'd like to, you can click right there on the screen coming up. And by subscribing, you'll get an email every week telling you I upload a new video. Comments or suggestions go down below. I do try and respond to everybody. Thank you guys again for watching. I got some oatmeal to finish. Stay healthy.